Good morning, my dear students of this academy. Exercise four, looking back, chapter divide. Okay, let's solve this divide. Three six zero nine seven three divide by forty two. So forty two is a divisor. Big number is called dividend. Eight five nine four is a question, and twenty five is a remainder. So first of all, how to solve this question? You have to write down forty two table. Okay, and then you have to solve this question. Understood. You already know that how to solve divide. Divide. Okay. Let's see the next question. One nine six nine nine seven divide by fifty. So look at here how to solve fifty again. Divisor. Big number is dividend. Three nine three nine is a question and four seven is a remainder. Okay. Let's see the next one. Two seven four five one six divide by sixty three. So again sixty three is a Six divisor two seven four five one six dividend four three five four. This is a question. Fourteen is a remainder. Again forty nine two five eight two double seven divided by forty nine. Again you have to do, write down forty nine table. Then you have to just do this uh, divide and then you have to just uh, find it your. Question five three zero seven question three four is a remainder. Divide and check how to check and have to do. So first of all eight three five divide by thirty nine. So thirty nine is a divisor. Big number is called dividend. Twenty one is a question here and sixteen is a remainder here. Okay then again fifty seven, sixty nine is a question. Twenty five is a remainder. Then forty eight. Three hundred fifty, three hundred. Then fifty nine divided by forty eight. So look at here. Six two six is a quotient, and eleven is a remainder here. Let's see the next question. About thirteen thousand two hundred babies are born in the world every hour. Okay, hour. About how many are born in a minute solution here? One hour is equal to sixteen. You already know that one hour. It's called as sixty minutes. Sixty minutes means how many hours? One hour, right? So one three two zero zero divided by sixty, so two twenty. Okay, so hence two twenty babies are born in a minute. So how many will be total? If we do what? Thirteen thousand two hundred they are given here. Thirteen thousand two hundred divided by sixty. So you have two twenty answer. So hence two twenty babies are born in a minute. 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 So which is the meaningless here? Meaningless is zero uh, upon seventeen is a meaningless. Okay, otherwise uh, all here look at here. This is a divide. Okay, a girl knits seven eighteen stitches. If there are twenty five stitches in each row of knitting an hour, so how many complete rows have been knitted? Knitted means क्या होता है बुनना होता है ना? So a girl ने knits किया seven eighteen stitches किए. ठीक है? See the house then. ठीक है? And if there are twenty five उसने का stitches कर दिए each row में knitting n hour में ठीक है knitting के so how many complete rows have been knitted कितने उसमें क्या complete करेगी वो ठीक है so what we have to do here we have to just divide this question seven eighteen by twenty five so twenty eight is a remainder twenty uh, eight is a uh, quotient and eighteen is a remainder here hence twenty eight rows have been knitted knitted हो जाएंगे with seven hundred stitches से and eighteen जो stitches हो जाएंगे वो आपके remainder रह गए तो वो आपके more गए okay This is the next question. A rocket traveled at a speed of two nine seven six zero kilometers an hour. Okay, so how many kilometers would the rocket travel in one minute at this speed? Speed का बताना है. तो आपको solution क्या निकालेंगे one hour में फिर से क्या होता है sixty minutes होता है ठीक है. तो हम क्या करेंगे two nine seven six zero को divide कर देंगे sixty से तो हमारे पास कितना आ जाएगा answer? Four hundred ninety six kilometer. So hence the required distance is four hundred ninety six kilometers. Okay. The product of two numbers is seven hundred seven one four two four. That means seven thousand one tens hundred thousand ten thousand. So seventy one thousand four hundred twenty four. Okay. So if one number is ninety three, so what is the other number? So solution that other number seven one four two four divided by ninety three is coming 
768. So hence the required number is 768. In a garden there are 4891. That means 4891 trees in 67 rows. Okay. So if each row may agar same number ke trees honge. So how many trees are there in one row? Solution kya aega? 4891 to divide kar dena 67 se. So aapke paas kitne aajengi? 73 trees aajengi. Hence there are 73 trees in a row.